My name is Kamale Correa, and this is my draft story. With the 42nd pick in the 2016 NFL Draft, Kamale Correa. Going into draft weekend and draft day, emotions are crazy. I'm back home in Hawaii with my family. Uh, you know, just kind of hang out with the people who, who essentially mean the most to me, who has been there for me from day one when I wasn't anything. Uh, just emotions are going crazy, you know. Your, you know, your friends calling and texting you. Where you going, man? Where you think you're going? You know, your family's they say, hey, I want you to be a cowboy. Hey, I want you to be, be a niner. And at the same time, it's like, you're just trying to remain calm and, and really just listen to God. I'm a person of, I gotta know, I gotta know. So I'm calling my agent at the time. Where am I going? What's gonna happen? Who likes me? Who wants to draft me? Who wants me? And I'm just going crazy, going crazy. And then I'm just trying to remember to remain calm. And it's not where I wanna go, but it's where God wants me to go. And on the first day, uh, you know, I'm hearing some rumors like, hey, you might go late first, you might go late first, and blah, blah, blah. We got all these teams. And in my head, I'm like, wow, I'm really about to be a first round draft pick. And it didn't go the way that I wanted. And the second day comes around and we're waiting, we're waiting. And my agent says, you're gonna get drafted soon. And we're waiting, we're waiting. And we get a call from Baltimore, Maryland. No, no name on the call, just a number with a 443 area code. I remember like it was yesterday. And the first person I talked to on the phone was Ozzie Newsom uh, from the Ravens. He calls, he's like, hey, you know, we're on the board. Uh, we're pick number 42, we're up next. Um, and we just wanna, wanna ask you if you wanna be a Baltimore Raven. And I just broke down. Um, I lost it. I ain't even gonna lie. I was a big crybaby that day. Like you know, just looking over and seeing, seeing my brothers, seeing my mom, you know, just all breaking down because this is a lifelong dream that you work for continually, and you put blood, sweat, tears, effort, sacrifices, just everything, and for all those people to see the hard times that you've been through, the good times you've been through. I mean, through a scholarship in college, man, we thought that was big. And when we got that call from Ozzy, I mean, my whole life just changed. And still to this day, I'm so thankful that I was drafted and I was given the opportunity from the Baltimore Ravens. But now I'm a Tennessee Titan. And I'm so lucky that the Titans actually took a chance on me again because I honestly don't know where my career would have went. And I'm grateful to all the Titans and to the Titans organization for Give me a shot, tighten up.